Hey everybody, welcome back. Um, I hope everybody is staying nice and healthy. Everybody's safe at home. And um, yeah, let's um, let's get started on today's activity. Um, today I'm gonna show you guys how to make a magic eight ball. If you've never used one, it's those little, well, it's like a pool ball, like a cue ball. And usually find them like at the stores, like like the, the black, the, I think it's the black one, yeah. It's the black cue ball with the number eight on it. And then you shake it and you answer it and you ask it a question and then it gives you like, yes, no, maybe, or ask again later. And then like, it comes up like in a little window and you see it come up like, and then you see it like up against the glass. So uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna teach you guys how to make one at home. Okay, so I hope you guys enjoy and I'll see you guys over at the supplies. Okay, so for this activity, what you're gonna need is a jar. You can either choose to use a regular size mason jar, or you can use the, the ones for the baby food, preferably a smaller one, but I'm gonna use this one. You can, um, you're gonna need some glue, some crafting glue, some permanent markers, some scissors, tape, some crafting foam, you're gonna need this, and then for the for the styrofoam cube, you're gonna have. And that's pretty, that pretty much covers. Oh, hold on, I'm forgetting one more thing. And you're gonna need some water. Very, very important. I'll forget the water. You don't need an exact amount of water, just as long as you fill this jar up to the top. But I mean, you can do straight from the faucet, but I chose to fill up a cup and just pour it in, into here for convenience sake. But you can, you can pour the water straight into the jar right from your faucet, so. Okay, so for the, fir for the first step, you're gonna get a small square of foam and you're gonna cut it into six square pieces. I'm gonna go ahead and do that. Set that aside. And then there you go. Second of it, that's too long. There you go. So you have your six. One, two, three, four, five, and six. And then for each square, you're gonna write the answers that you usually see on a magic eight ball. So you're gonna write. You're gonna write yes. You're gonna write this one two times. So one. Two. You're gonna write. No, once. You're gonna write maybe once. You're gonna write I don't know once, or you can shoot, or you can put IDK if you know what IDK stands for. So I, it means this. I don't know, and then. You can either put try or ask again. So I'm gonna put ask again. Just like that. Okay, and then for the next part, you're gonna get your glue and you're gonna stick on your squares of foam onto your styrofoam square and make sure it sticks well or else it's not going to work once you once you go into the next step and you can put them into you can put them in ra in random spots on the cube if you want it doesn't have to be specific so, so just remember that have fun with it Thank you. 
maybe maybe I'll put it right there see what I did there <laughs> Yes. And there you have your answer cube. Okay, so after you have your cube, you're gonna get your jar, you're gonna open it. Okay, you're gonna get your cube, you're gonna place it in the jar. squares don't come off of it just kind of shake it a little bit and if not open it back up and pour your water then pour your water into your jar Make sure your square, your cube comes all the way up to the top to where it meets the lid. So if it does that, then you pour the right amount. You don't want it filling up too much. And then close it up again and then just test it for leaks. Make sure it doesn't leak because if it leaks, it's not screwed on right. And if it comes up, see how it floats up. And then you're free to decorate the jar after that. Okay, so after you've finished decorating your jar, I have, I'm about to be done. So I'm just gonna draw little question marks on here. With the fancy silver Sharpie. The most elusive of them all. Now free to ask away. Um, let's see. Will is it going to rain next week? I hope not. Let's let's ask. Ask again, is it going to rain next week? I don't know. Oh man, okay. Um, let's see, what other questions could we ask? <laughs> let's see. Should I buy an ice cream today? Ask again. Please say yes, please say yes. Should it buy an ice cream today? Yes! Okay, sorry. See? The, 
the jar wants me to buy an ice cream and I'm gonna go buy an ice cream. That's how it works, ladies and gentlemen. I'll leave you guys with that. I'm gonna go buy myself an ice cream. I mean, the jar told me to, so just kidding. <laughs> okay, um, well anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, I hope you guys have more fun with it. I hope you guys have a lot of more creative designs. Um, as with the other videos, feel free to post them down in the comments when this video is posted. And, also leave some questions yeah um leave some questions for other people to ask their jars you know um it'll be fun i i think so but yeah um i hope you guys enjoyed and i'll see you in the next one peace